a final march past of servicemen and women of fighter command. It was the end of a remarkable chapter in Air Force history, a chapter which men like these helped write during the Battle of Britain. They were the pilots who beat off the entire might of the Luftwaffe. They served in fighter command. But this ceremony marked the end of that wing of the Royal Air Force as an individual entity. Air Marshal Sir Frederick Rosier inspected his men. The roar of jets, today's fighting planes, screamed overhead in a flight past tribute to the men and the planes of an era which brought greatness to fighter command. The Hurricane and Spitfire, two nimble flying machines which kept the enemy out. After 32 years, the famous RAF Command was being merged with Bomber Command under the reorganization of the Air Force. Their combined title is Strike Command. But though its individuality has gone, Fighter Command's heroes and their heroic deeds will never be forgotten.